Hello everybody and welcome back to music class. Today we're going to review something that we talked about last year called rhythm. Now we've spent a lot of this week remembering about steady beat and how it stays the same and is the beat of music. But while that steady beat is happening in a song, something else could be going on top of it. So I've got my beat going beat, 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 beat. But I could say while it's going, I could go, hey, how are you? Hope you're doing fine today. And I can change up and I can have different rhythms on top of it. So if we looked like we had before, um, we did our steady beat drawing yesterday and here was mine. I had my four hearts that were here. And if we were looking at a song, it would keep it steady. But we could put something else on top of it called rhythms. I'm going to put a couple up here. And now we've got those, and they've got some of the ones we saw last year. So it can have ta, which is one sound, tt, two sounds. We can have a rest that's no sound, and then we can be right here back at ta again. So I'm going to clap. The beat's going to keep going on. You're going to hear a little ticking. The beat's going to be going, and I'm going to clap this pattern. Keep it steady. Ta, tt, rest, ta. So as you can see, I can clap, I can do something different, a different amount of sounds while the steady beat is going. So I just reviewed some of those, but let's look at them real quick again. So we had the one that looked like this. It's got one bubble on it and a line that goes out top, and we called that one ta. We also had a little hand sign with our fingers for that one where we put them on top and we slid them and went ta. Ta is one sound. Together, it's one sound. The next one, this one's got two bubbles and they're attached by lines together and this one was called a TT. It's two sounds together. So if we took our fist, we had our little sign for this one. We tap them together and go TT. All right, so we've got ta, TT. And then this other one we learned was a rest, which means we rested our voices, our hands, and we didn't make any sound at all. It was silent. So I had my finger over my mouth every time we had a rest to make sure we didn't make a sound. So if I was going to do this rhythm again, I'm going to do it with my hand signs this time and say it. Ta, T, T, Ta. Now as we're reviewing some of these, I want to give you a chance for you to make some of your own music today with those rhythms. So I'm going to show you this fun online thing where you get to choose which rhythms are created and you can practice clapping along with them at home. So I'm going to jump over there and show you that rhythm maker. All right, everybody, so here is our rhythm maker. It's got lots of things on it that we can do. And you can see first that it's got the heartbeats. It's got the steady beat of the song. And it has 16 of them up here, which means we can fill them in with 16 rhythms of your choice. At the bottom, you can see the ones that are choosing. We've got, they look a little different, but the one on the left is TT, one in the middle is Ta, and the one on the right is your rest. So I'm going to choose, and when I click on one, it's going to appear in the next bubble. So ta, ti, 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 ta, 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 rest, rest. And look, I filled the whole top line up already. Then I can keep going and choose some other ones. All right, so I've got my pattern made, and now I can click play, and it will play it right back to me. Here it goes. So you can listen to it, but you can also practice along with them. So I'm going to click play again, and this time I'm going to practice with them by clapping my hands and saying the rhythm. Ta, ti, 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 ta, ta. Ta, ta, ti, ti, ta, ti, ti, ta, ti, ti. And then I've got my pattern. And now if you want to hear it played in different ways, there's instruments you can choose from. So that one was hand clapping. There's also drums. Triangle. Piano. There's 
also the sticks that you can play on these. So there's lots of options for you to be able to make your own. This is going to be our little bit of review today on what those rhythms look like and what they sound like. So all you have to do is do one of these and you do not have to turn anything in today. I just want you to enjoy some music making and to remember our rhythms. I'm going to jump on back to our video now. Alrighty, so that's all you need to do today is just try out that rhythm maker and remember some of the ones that we learned before. It should be on your playlist, a link to it, as well as in Google Classroom. So go ahead, try it out, and enjoy making some rhythm. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day, and I'll talk to you again soon. Bye!